Hello viewers, uh, today in this video I will be discussing regarding the distance measures in big data. So uh, there are five main types of the distance measures uh, which we measure using the uh, big data that is the data which is uh, coming from the various sources. So they are classified under the five main uh, uh, divisions that is first that is the Euclidean distance, uh, next is the Jacquard distance next is the cosine distance then is the edit distance and finally is the hamming distance so uh, let us see uh, what this consists of and we'll see uh, one problem in uh, each of these sections so first of all uh, euclidean distance euclidean distance is uh, basically the distance between two different points at two different levels such as a uh, mountain level or between a sea level so it is uh, classified under the uh, general formula that is LR is given by summation i is from 1 to n that is xi minus yi raised to r the entire thing raised to 1 by r so uh, the these two norms that is the L1 norm and L2 norm are based upon this uh, generalized formula based upon the equivalent distance so uh, by changing various parameters which we can actually get some new forms of formulas which we can use in our subsequent uh, problems for solving different kinds of scenarios. So first of all, uh, talking about the L1 norm, uh, we have this mod of x1 minus x2 plus mod of y1 minus y2. Obviously, I will be covering uh, these problems uh, based upon each of this. So let us uh, have a brief idea regarding uh, these formulas and how it came from. Uh, next talking about the L2 norm, L2 norm is similar to this uh, general formula uh, just by substituting the value of R as 2 uh, we get under root summation i is from 1 to n xi minus yi the whole square. Uh, next uh, we have the Manhattan distance, so Manhattan distance is basically the distance between two cities. Uh, Manhattan is actually a city uh, where uh, this distance is uh, calculated. So the name uh, gets from uh, those city so it is also called as the cab driver distance so this is uh, basically this Manhattan distance or the cab driver distance uh, next we can compute the maximum of uh, these two values that is xi and yi so that is given by this L infinity that is max of xi minus yi and this entire uh, formulation is uh, based upon the modulus since you can note distance cannot be negative so it has to be under the mod sign so every value we evaluate uh, it is going to be coming in the positive uh, scale so this is the Euclidean distance next we move on to the Jacquard distance so Jacquard distance uh, is the distance measure uh, given by a scientist named uh, Jacquard so it is uh, giving the distance between two different points that is denoted as ds that is a distance between two points a and b is given as 1 minus js that is the jacobian distance jacquardian distance between a comma b and in set theory it is represented as a union b minus a intersection b upon mod a intersection b this can also be further summarized as 1 minus a intersection b upon a uh, yeah that is a union b uh, this is actually a union b so this is the jacquard distance next we move on to the cosine distance now cosine distance is a distance measure that we get from our trigonometrics likewise we have the sine distance cosine tangent cotangent secant distance so uh, one uh, most common that is uh, measure is a cosine distance and this distance uh, measures between 0 to 180 degrees and its formula is given by cos of d1 comma d2 that is between two points is given as d1 dot d2 their product divided by mod of d1 into mod of d2 we have other alternative formula to this that is summation i is from 1 to n ai into bi divided by the uh, 
uh, square root of summation i is from 1 to n the ai square all the values of ai that is the a points are calculated and it is given under a square root multiplied by summation i is from 1 to n di square so this is the cosine distance next we move on to the edit distance so edit distance is uh, given by mod x plus mod y minus 2 lcs x comma y now what is this lcs lcs is the longest common subsequence suppose uh, we have two points or we have two different words which have some common characters in between so the frequency of those characters or how many times these characters are repeating those are given in the lcs that is the lowest common subsequence so it is written that is the how many insertions or deletions are required to convert from x to y that is uh, how many number of or how many moves or steps are required from uh, converting the uh, the question to the answer next we move on to the hamming distance hamming distance is the uh, most uh, widely or the uh, most uh, useful uh, distance uh, in the network analysis and so in the big data analysis uh, it comes into the picture so we have the hamming distance hamming distance is nothing but uh, we calculate the change of variation between two different points suppose uh, if two different points of 0 1 0 and 0 1 1 1 uh, is given uh, then we calculate that how many bit positions are these two variables changing so it is nothing but the number of bit positions where the two items or values differ so these are the five distance 